So unless you are wildly wealthy, I think it's safe to say we could all use a little extra money. So what if we told you that if you just took a couple of minutes online and did some searching, you could end up with some unclaimed property or even money that's owed to you. That would be a pretty cool gift, right? Today is National Unclaimed Property Day. Our Rafael Sanchez Cruz is here to break down how you can get your hands on some cash or even some valuables you didn't know were missing. Rafa? Yeah, that Rolex that you've been missing, Simone. The first <laughs> step is get out your phone and open your camera setting. You'll see that QR code that's right at the corner there. We'll hover your camera over it. And when a link pops up, it'll take you directly to WUSA 9. That's our article that has all the steps you need to get your money back, whether you live in D.C., Maryland, or Virginia. One in seven people has some kind of unclaimed property just waiting to be collected, according to the National Association of Unclaimed Property Administrators. This might be an inactive checking account, a missed paycheck, utility refund, or even valuables like this jewelry that's just waiting to be picked up by their owners, according to the Maryland Office of the Controller. The National Association of State Treasurers has set up unclaimed.org, where you can search for your state and it will take you directly to the website to start your search. Let's take Virginia, for example. You enter your last name or the name of your business. To narrow your search, you can also include a city, zip code, and property ID. You'll then be taken to a list of potential properties that might be yours. You select those that match with your information, and then you start your claim. Getting your money or property will require further personal information and proper identification. Some states and provinces have also partnered up with MissingMoney.com, which requires the same steps to track your property in different states. This is a tool for those that have moved around the country. The National Association of Unclaimed Property Administrators urges people to only use legitimate sites on their website because you are being asked to enter personal information. Now we want to be clear, getting your property can take a couple weeks. DC, for example, says their average wait time is 30 days. The average claim, according to the National Association of State Treasurers, is $2,080 enough for Simone and Adam to pay for dinner next time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. And actually some people, guys, did it in the newsroom earlier today and they found money that, the, that was owed to them from other states that they haven't been living in for years. And I might even get some $25 here in DC. Ooh, so okay. it doesn't hurt just to check, right? Boy, that like would the be sound fun. of that. Yeah. But it just takes a couple minutes to go on a website. You can do it. So, so remember, fine. thanks, Rafa. If you if you want to see again, if you have any unclaimed items or cash, just scan that. Just take a picture of that uh, QR code right there. The link will pop up to take you to our WSA9 article. We've got all the steps you need to know to get your money back. All right. May the odds be ever in your favor, Rafa. Thank you.